When it comes to the big issues in life, you want to find the source that speaks with integrity and can point you in the right direction. That's what the teaching office of the church is for. In matters of faith, Catholics have developed a structure of authority known as the Magisterium. The Magisterium is entrusted with the deposit of faith. The deposit of faith, the Catechism tells us, doesn't belong to the clergy alone, but is the treasure of the whole church. The deposit of faith comes in two parts, Scripture and Tradition. Scripture comes from the Bible the book that was compiled and edited and confirmed by the early church leaders. The tradition of the church is therefore responsible for scripture as we know it. The text existed and the community existed. And when the two came together, inspired by the Holy Spirit, both scripture and tradition took their first unified breath. The magisterium, the teaching authority of the church, provides and promotes scripture which is no longer added to, and tradition, which is vital and expanding in each new age. Sometimes, church leaders are mistaken, because they are human beings prone to partial understanding and honest mistakes. When this happens, the grassroots faithful to whom the Holy Spirit is likewise entrusted must lead the way. The Spirit draws up from the whole body a sense of the faithful that engenders change in the church understanding. This is known as sensus fidelium. The faithful can and will do that because of the very deposit of faith the magisterium protects and which inspires us all.